Howdy, homesteaders. I'm going to work on the dog cage today. And I'm trying to get this uh, dog cage up to speed so we can leave the dog in there overnight. But it's supposed to rain, so I need to try to find some way to keep him dry. And also I want to put some... Uh, blockage up to block the sun uh, for whenever it is sunny. The idea I have is to, I'm going to take this uh, this wire right here. I'm going to stretch this over the top. It's a garden uh, fence wire. And I'm going to try to use this to support a tarp over the top and see if that's enough to keep them dry. Double it up and kind of sandwich. I'm gonna sandwich the tarp in between and see how that works. And that's how I'm gonna do it. I got this wire, it came off of the spool that I got from the big box hardware store. So I figured, hey, it's a, it's a nice little wire, I'm going to go ahead and use that to tie it down with. Now, it seems like it's going to work. What I ended up doing is, each one of these, I just went and clipped them to make them free. And then what I'm going to do is, I'm going to do it like I did this one, I'm just going to wrap it around the pole, like I did with this right here. So I wrapped it around. If I do that with all of them, that might be enough to hold it. It might be better than just using a it might be better than using this wire right here. going across the top and it's kind of drooping across there which I expected it's just wire and it's not gonna be a perfect solution I think it's gonna be good enough and uh, I'm just keep going okay it was a little bit tedious every little wire I had to put on there and everything but I think it turned out all right to have a cage on top, All right? And then I've got a cage on the bottom, and it's kind of like a little sandwich in there. And I got all the little rings on the tarp tied down with some wire. So 
think it's going to turn out all right. As you can see, there's a slope. That way the water doesn't pull up in there and create a big pocket of water. Hopefully, I'm hoping it just runs off. So, and it is a dog, so hopefully that's enough to keep the water off the dog. If not, I will improvise some more. Thank you.